atoms and molecules. Laws of chemical combination Before we could learn more about chemical combination between particles of matter, let's learn the laws of chemical combination. The law of conservation of mass states that mass can neither be created nor destroyed in a chemical reaction. Let's take an example. Hydrogen burns in air, that is, combines with oxygen to form water. From this law of conservation of mass, the mass of the reactants, that is the mass of hydrogen and oxygen, is equal to the mass of the products, that is, the mass of water formed after the reaction. The law of constant proportion states that in a chemical substance, the elements are always present in definite proportions by mass. This law is also known as the law of definite proportions. Let's take the same example of combustion of hydrogen forming water. Hydrogen and oxygen combine in the ratio 2 is to 1 to form water. From the law of constant proportion, this ratio of hydrogen and oxygen to form water is always 2 is to 1. Water is represented as H2O implies that water contains two parts of hydrogen and one part of oxygen. 